Hi, Cornerstone family. It's Pastor Chris, and welcome to day 11 in our journey to Easter. And uh, today I want to uh, share with you John 17. It's, it's one of the most important and central scripture for the, for the Christian to live out. Uh, in this scripture, Jesus prays in accordance to the will of the Father. And here's the key, in submission to the Father for living out his life. Uh, wouldn't it be nice if we had access that uh, the delights of our Heavenly Father would be lived out in our life, that our heart's prayer would be accomplished? And it's, it's available to you and me, Jesus says. It says in John 17, 26, here's the key in our faith lesson. Jesus says, I made known to them your name, our Heavenly Father, and I will continue to make it known. And the love in which you have loved me may be in them and I in them. Imagine this, that we can have the same love in us which God the Father loved Jesus. The same delight of the Father that was lived out in Jesus could be in our lives. Imagine if your prayer life was accomplished. I want to give you the key in the faith lesson today of doing that. It's simply this. It's being in submission to the Father's delight and His will in your life. Um, think of the magnitude of the love of the Father that it would be poured out, that it would be revealed, that it would be given to you as we move into Easter. It's simply this, submit yourself to the will of the Father. That he has a, an abundant life for you to be lived out, and all you have to do is, in humility, like Jesus, to submit yourself to the Father and to give yourself. It's simply this one word, it's surrender. Um, here's day 11, our day, our, our day 11 faith lesson. Allow your desires to, to be conformed to our Heavenly Father's desires. And you will experience for yourself the immeasurable love which God the Father had for His Son. Um, that we would pray this, Lord, help us to set our lives aside before you during this Easter season, that we would stand and sit at your right hand and that our, our prayer life would be accomplished by simply doing this, by submitting ourselves, surrendering ourselves. To, to God in our life. Uh, Heavenly Father, we pray that the delight of, of God, our Father, would be present in our life as we move to Easter, that you would allow your, your presence to be flooded into our dry and weary places in our lives, in our hearts, in our minds. And Lord, thank you that you call us your chosen portion. You call us the apple of your eye. And thank you, Heavenly Father, that you gave your Son for us as a chance to meet with you right now. That's the Easter story. And in day 11, in this journey to Easter, we simply open up our hearts. We surrender to the delights of your love in our life. That's our prayer, Heavenly Father. Amen.